Hello, hope you are doing good. In this video, I will be showing you how to make shirt mock-up in Canva for free. The first thing you want to do after creating your Canva account, you are going to go over to the left-hand menu option. And from there, you are going to tap on apps. After selecting apps, you are just going to scroll down until you see mock-ups. You are going to tap on that. Then from there, you can select apparel right below the navigation bar. After selecting apparel, you can see different options. You have sweatshirts, t-shirts, hoodies, tank tops, and also sportswear as you can see right there. There are numerous options you can select from. Since this example is based around shirts, we're going to be selecting t-shirt. After selecting t-shirt, you can see you can even go further by sub in it, for example, you can select long sleeve t-shirts, you can select short sleeve t-shirt, women's t-shirt, kids t-shirt, teen t-shirt, unisex, garment only t-shirt, and so on. So you can select whichever one of these options. Let's say for example sake, we were to select men t-shirt, you can see the different mockups right here, and you could select whichever one of these is to your liking. Keep in mind any one of the mockups that you will see with the crown that says pro, that means that you would have to be a paid subscriber on Canva to use that particular mockup. And I do recommend that you go onto the paid plan as it offers numerous features and it is quite affordable and it is best if you are planning to do this professionally that you go onto the Canva paid plan as you want all of the features that they offer. For example, let's say this mockup right here. Now all you'll need to do is tap on select. After you have selected select from there, you can select the design that you would like to add. So for example sake, let's say I would like to add this design. So I'm going to select this and I'm just going to tap on select right here. And you can see how it would look. Once you're finished, you can also change the color by tapping on the color circle. So for example sake, if I would like to use a blue t-shirt for example, I can select blue as you can see right there. I could also change it to this color. So it is completely up to you. You have numerous editing options. You can also tap on adjust image and if you would like to adjust your design, you can do that. Once you're finished, you're going to tap on save mockup. After you have selected save mockup, you can choose to either use it in a design on Canva or you could tap on download. After you have selected download, you can see our mock-up right here and you can see that it does look professional. And if you'd like to further edit it, you can also remove the background and then you could add your own background if you want. To do this, all I would recommend you do once you're back on Google, you could simply open a new tab, then you could type in remove background. After selecting remove background, you'll go on to remove.bg. This is a platform that you can use to remove your background for completely free. So you're going to tap on upload image, select the design that you have created. So let me do that real quick. This design, you'll tap on open. After you have selected open, you'll just give it a few seconds while it does its magic. Once it is finished, you're going to tap on download. So let's do that real quick. After it has been downloaded, you could go back into Canva. Once back on Canva, you could change the background to whatever you want. So for example, we could go over to the top left hand corner, tap on home. Then from there, you can decide the design that you want. So let's say you're creating this design to share on social media. We could select social media. Then for example sake, we could select Instagram story. After doing that, you could add the background that you would like to use. So you could select elements from the left hand menu option and let's say for example I want to add a street vibe so I can type in street right here then tap on enter after doing that I could select photos or videos and you can see different layouts then let's say this one I'll drag and place it then tap on the three dots then tap on set image as background after doing that you're going to tap on uploads from the left hand menu option then select upload file and you're going to be selecting the design that you have removed the background then you'll tap on open and you can just drag and place it right here so you can see how it looks right here keep in mind that this is just a rough example 
so you can see how it looks right there so that's how you'll be able to change the background and add in your own background if you want for a mock-up hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe and thank you for watching